school board um, for giving me this opportunity. I'd like to thank Coach Duffield, the athletic department, Miss Lane, for also giving this chance. And um, I'd like to thank Coach Blankenship. Um, he's been an unbelievable blessing to me and just giving me the, the mentorship and the guidance to get me where I'm at and to open up doors for myself is um, be forever grateful because it gave me an opportunity to, ch to change my life and my family life and generations. Um, so that's that's important to me. Um, so I had to make sure, you know, I'm, I'm gonna be honest, I wrote this speech and made sure I got all this stuff ready. But um, if you don't know me, I go straight from the heart. So that, that, that's off the script right now. So uh, this is what's real. And so um, first thing first, I gotta give a shout out to my wife and my um, family over there. And without her, and she's raising my um, my little crazy little son and my daughter. It's been a, um, a blessing. Also, I got family that moved, came from Alabama, and that came down here, and friends. And man, it took a village to raise me. Um, and it wasn't just I can't just thank one person, but I'm grateful for a lot of them. And so. I can't just say one person did something. I gotta give a lot of people credit. My uncles and my my family over here, my aunt, my high school coaches. Um, that, it was a straight village, and, and it wasn't easy because I know I was hard headed, and it, and it still ain't easy sometimes. So that's just the the, the realness. And so one thing I want to say that um, a lot of people always say, Coach, you know, you falling behind. Coach Blankenship, a legend. How is that, you know, you pressured up? But I had a good conversation with myself. I said, what's pressure is growing up in poverty as a young man and making it and trying to figure out your next meal. What's pressure is um, being the oldest grandson, grandchild of 36 and being the oldest of six siblings and being a great example for them and making sure you, you move and everything you do. Um, got to be the right decisions you make because they look up to you. That's pressure. Um, what's pressure is making sure I lead by example for these young men and everything I got to do in life because I, I hope and pray that they look at, up to me as a as a man. What's pressure being a minority and breaking barriers and and doing the right thing and and just making sure you can't uh, you can't afford to make a, a wrong mistake. That's pressure. What's pressure is, um, man, pressure is, is nothing because I already been through all that in life. And um, I look at it as a blessing to follow behind this man. I don't look at it as pressure. So when people say, are you so pressured up? No, nah, because I've been going through pressure my whole life and I've been beating it. So, and that's just how I feel about that. So I look at it as a challenge. I look at it as a blessing. And I thank God that um, I'm, I'm able to be in this situation where I could be a mentor for um, young men and um, others in my buddies in the back that I coached with and others in the past. And so I also got to make sure I thank the guys on this staff um, that's been a part of this journey. They're really good friends of mine. And, um, they also have been uh, uh, unbelievable blessings to me. And I'm sure that there's a, a lot of people that I'm leaving out, but um, it's been a blessing. I have to make sure um, I started coaching in 2009 at Union High School. Kurt Frederick um, gave me an opportunity and, and opened the door. And so I'm also grateful for um, Coach Fred because he saw a young man um, that wanted to get into coaching and I able to I was able to um, <laughs> to um, that's what kids do. So, uh, I was able to accomplish a lot of goals in life there. So I I'll be grateful for him and so um, this is awesome and I appreciate everybody taking the time out of their day to attend this and um we're gonna they in trouble. <laughs> so let's get to work and I'm ready. Thank you.